now. Oh yeah, don't die. See? Hi everyone, I'm Maka. Welcome back to my channel. It's been a long, long time and I'm very excited to be back. I'm pretty sure you remember my house tour, right? Like I'm gonna link it here so you can go back if you haven't done that so. Things change a little bit drastically from the last time that I show you my house since we started the renovation. And I'm gonna show you how we are living right now after all the mess and it's really bad. So yay, so let's do it. I just can't believe that we actually are living under this mess. Uh, yeah, so when you come in, um, this is the first thing that you see when you come to my house. All the mess that the different teams that are working are leaving behind. The double sink, it's been here for the longest time ever. And it's gonna be here for a few more days. <laughs> Okay. This is a mess. Okay. <laughs> we used to have an entrance, and you will see it in the in the video that I linked uh, of my home. But now it's a uh, pretty much um, how can you say that storage area? However, Moshi loves this part because he's it's like his personal corner. Uh, where he greets people every time they dump things outside. This is where we keep all the things that are not gonna be used yet in the construction, but somehow ended up here in the entrance. So we used to have <laughs> uh, an organized cute uh, entrance closet here. Now it's replaced by this massive, massive heater, huh? hot water tank. Oh my god, more baseboards! Shocking! I didn't know that. And this is how we've been living the past um, 100 days. So let me see if I can go out alive. <laughs> now, um, stairs of the office, stairs of the old office, also part of the storage area. Of course, never-ending storage area where you can find pretty much anything. Let's go down, it gets worse. Where should we start? <laughs> so these baseboards are the future baseboards and trims uh, of the second floor and they have been sitting here for at least a minimum of two months. So every time you go to use the bathroom, you have to jump, like, this has been my life. <laughs> and it's actually really, oh shit, it's actually really fun for my cat. He totally loves this situation. Okay, as soon as you go down and you see the baseboards, let's go to the kids' room, because uh, it's really bad. <laughs> um, so, Remember when I told you in the last video that we were gonna have the stairs done uh, where my closet was? This is part of my closet. We had to run to Ikea to get as many storage bags as humanly possible. <laughs> and then we basically kept everything in here. So every time we have to look like, we need to change the sheets. Where are the sheets? Sikam. Pillowcase is here. Yay! <laughs> Laura, this is so bad. <laughs> so I have no clue how I've been surviving, but this is my life now. <laughs> Yay! So now, uh, when you go into the living area slash kitchen, um, I used to have <laughs> I used to have an area to sit here. Um, and then these um, curtain boards arrived last week. Actually, they also don't deliver anything upstairs. They drop everything here. So no delivery is actually capable of like putting everything up. So I, that's why this is the way it is. Fun fact, this is also what the inside of my brain looks like. 
So yeah, so these curtain boards are gonna go upstairs for the future tiles and you cannot use this area anymore. So yay! <laughs> Living room is way better. I actually share on Instagram uh, behind the scenes when we had to move the closet out, like the how was the first night? And it was absolutely horrible because we had to empty everything in 24 hours. So it was like me running to Ikea to get things and like that. But now you can actually see the floor, which is a really good sign that things are going better <laughs> in here. Uh, however, I have my shoes here all in my suitcase. So that's why I've been wearing the same shoes since this um, started. It's, it's, you know, pointless at this point. So remember when we talk about the dust? And yeah, look. I don't recommend living in your house when you're doing a major reno. Like, just move out. Don't do what I did. Like, I cleaned this morning. Like, how is this even possible? <laughs> I was actually sleeping here in this couch, like with bags here, and I was like this, not moving. Like, like this. <laughs> like a mom, mombi, like a zombie. So bad. <laughs> and I decided to actually sleep here because I had COVID during the thing and I didn't want to like, you know, contaminate other humans. So I stayed here and then I like decided to sleep here the entire reno. <laughs> I saw I was sleeping with Nico, <laughs> also in the like tiniest little bed, twin bed. And um, Actually, this week, after 115 days, we have the bathroom back. It's actually happening. Oh, and I slept in an actual bed. That was so good. <laughs> Disclaimer, don't do, this, don't do this at home. Don't try to do this at home. You know, when you do like, no. Okay, so this is way better because it was really bad. We just got this back. Yeah, this is how far the door can open at the moment. It's actually decent right now. So uh, I remember that I used to have a walk-in closet. Now this is the new like setup that we're gonna have. And in the future, I'm gonna DIY a closet here. And this is gonna be the future guest room. So my dad is gonna be very happy. Future mattress <laughs> that it's coming up. It's like currently sleeping with us. This is my closet. At one point, I couldn't find my panties. <laughs> Hashtag what? And I just ended up buying, like, cause I was like, I gotta find socks, I gotta find this. So yeah, so that has been the story of our life. Uh, everything is um, in these bags just to prevent the dust to ruin everything because as you can see, it comes back magically after you clean. And yeah, I don't even know when am I gonna have a closet bag, but this is what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm just gonna do like if I see oh this is new <laughs> but yeah it's, it's really bad okay uh best part we left it for the end because it's just it's a chef's kiss so um remember my bathroom from the home tour it serves as a multi-purpose room so you can do many things in here come let me show you help <laughs> so remember that i had a pocket door here that it was connecting through my bathroom so that's gone because the stairs are in the back so they redid this whole wall and it's gonna remain like this but it's a multi room because my bathtub is a closet now and I keep, <laughs> I keep like uh, clothes handy, underwear, <laughs> things that we had in the storage that now we don't have the storage that are here. Um, we have suitcases filled with pajamas and many surprises. So every morning is a, like a new surprise, including like all oh, my suitcases are out. Not for a good reason though. <laughs> And it's the bathroom, right? So we shower here because it's the only one that we have. 
and the kids keep they keep asking so when is the path to back and i'm like not in service until further notice <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I'm so sorry you had to go through all this mess with me. I'm alive. I'm going to survive. We're almost there. And in the next episode, you have to stay tuned because we're going to show you the first sneak peek of the second floor and the update, the official update on YouTube of what we did the past 100 days over here. I hope to see you soon. Subscribe, like, comment. I cannot wait to see you. Bye. <laughs>